Parents, family members, students, we are getting ready to embark on a new venture and this is called the Go Connect One-to-One -one Venture and basically what it is is our goal within three years to put a laptop, a Chromebook specifically, into the hands of each of our middle school students. This is going to be a very huge undertaking. It's very important. There's a lot of reasons why we want to do this. The biggest is because we believe it's important for our students to learn to use 21st century technology. There's not anywhere that you're going to work in the future where you're not going to have to use the skills that it takes to use a laptop. Uh, but what is really neat about this is how it has the chance to change education for the better and to make us all stronger. One of the problems and challenges teachers have every day is coming up with enough resources to help all students learn no matter what level they're on or no matter what area they're strong in or what area they might need more help in. We believe that there's enough information out there beyond a textbook that where teachers can help students grow, help students perform, and help students achieve. And that's what it's really about, is student achievement. So we're excited about this initiative. We are all about it. We're getting ready to push it out there and just we want everyone else to understand how important this can be for our students. And so let's get on this one-to-one -one Go Connect adventure and let's have fun. Welcome to Bay District Schools Go Connect. We hope that you and your student are excited about this opportunity. This initiative is made possible by the Bay County Half Cent Sales Tax. The Chromebook One-to-One -one initiative is aligned to the Bay District Schools strategic goals and the State of Florida Digital Plan. Through this initiative, we are able to engage students with interactive digital content that continually reflects the new Florida standards and supports desired learning outcomes for all students. Leverage technology to empower students through personalized learning that promotes student and teacher collaboration, communication, critical thinking, and creativity. Prepare educators and administrators for the digital classroom by providing ongoing job embedded professional development. Build digital citizens by promoting ethical, helpful, and safe uses of technology. You might be asking yourself, why does Bay District Schools believe a one-to-one -one initiative is so important? It is our desire that the one-to-one -one initiative transform today's classrooms to classrooms that will allow our students to be collaborators, communicators, creative, and critical thinkers. We cannot keep preparing students for a world that will not exist. The U.S. Department of Labor predicts that 65% of today's school children eventually will be employed in jobs that have yet to be created. The new Florida standards do not have separate technology standards, but there are digital skill sets that students must demonstrate in all the core Florida standards. Take a look at these English language arts standards. Students must use technology, including the internet, to produce, publish, collaborate, and gather digital resources from multiple sources. Another reason why is that Florida state regulation states that for students to be eligible for graduation, they must take and pass at least one online course. Online courses may often require access beyond the school day. Students throughout the state of Florida are required to take state assessments, which many times are computer-based. The one-to-one -one initiative will allow students to practice computer skills before the day of the test. It will reduce the number of testing days. Chromebooks can easily be placed in kiosk mode where students can't access other websites and or accessories, such as the calculator. And teachers can provide just-in-time feedback after formatives. Our main source of funding for the Chromebook one-to-one -one rollout has been the Bay County Half Cent Sales Tax. Other funding sources include Digital Classroom Plan State Allocation, Textbook, E-Rate. But without the Bay County Half Cent Sales Tax, this initiative would not be possible. We would like to remind you that technology is a tool. It is not a goal. Bay District Schools has researched and collaborated with the following groups to help ensure this initiative is successful. These are a few of the frequently asked questions that we have received about the one-to-one -one initiative. How has Bay District Schools prepared for the one-to-one -one rollout? For the last three years, Bay District Schools has been updating wireless infrastructure to all of the schools and working to make sure the internet filtering system can be used both at school and at home. 
Instructional technology has structured professional development around the effective integration of technology. So why did Bay District Schools select the Chromebook device? Several items were considered, including but not limited to, simplicity. Teachers and students should be focused on teaching and learning, not figuring out the technology. Chromebooks are a completely web-based device, so there is no need for downloading or installing programs. The way a Chromebook operates reduces the need for the technology support. Student work on the Chromebook automatically saves to the cloud in the student's Google Drive, which makes it ideal considering Bay District Schools is a Google Apps district. The devices are able to be managed, which allows little downtime. Low cost. Performance. Reliability. In order for students to rely on these devices as instructional tools, the devices must be extremely reliable. Chromebooks do not suffer from the complexity and malware threat that plague other platforms. Simple support and maintenance. If a student device breaks, we can replace it and have them running in five minutes. Long battery life. Your device's battery has to last all day if you want to rely upon it as a tool. Compatibility. The district utilizes a variety of web-based instructional software and content which need to work with our devices. What will students receive? Students will receive one Dell Chromebook, one AC power adapter, and one protective cover. Will students take Chromebooks home? Yes, students will be allowed to take the Chromebooks home after the parent or guardian has signed the Chromebook contract and the student has agreed to the acceptable user policy. Each school will determine the distribution date. Dates will vary from school to school. Will the Chromebooks have any filters when used at home? Yes, the Chromebooks will have the same GoGuardian filtering that the students have while they're at school. How are students protected online? Whether at school or at home, students will be filtered by Bay District's internet filtering system called GoGuardian. The district utilizes internet filtering systems to reduce exposure to inappropriate content, even when the device is used at home. While we do our best to stay on top of things, some websites are not blocked or able to bypass our filters. Teachers and parents are encouraged to randomly check the browsing history of student Chromebooks on a regular basis. The district will also conduct random checks of student browsing histories. If you discover any inappropriate web activity, please contact your child's teacher, school principal, or media specialist. Inappropriate web browsing is a violation of the district's student authorized use policy and may result in disciplinary action. For more information on internet safety, please visit www.commonsensemedia.org and view the Parent Guide to Internet Safety. This website also provides links to more great information regarding internet and social media safety, as well as information on prevention and reporting of cyberbullying. Can the Chromebooks be used without wireless? Yes. The Chromebooks have functionality that's available offline. This means that students can work within some Google Apps in offline mode, even without internet access. Additionally, students can access downloaded PDFs or other local files. Online digital textbooks that have download PDF versions can also be accessed without an internet connection. How will students log into the Chromebook? Students will log into the Chromebook using their Bay District School Google account username and password. A student's Bay District Google account password is the same as their Bay District School password. Students must change their Bay District School password every 60 days. How will students access their online textbooks or other digital resources? Textbooks and many online resources are accessible through the Bay District School's Launchpad. Once students have logged into the Chromebook, students will be able to log into the Launchpad. Or they can go to www.bay.k12.fl.us and click on the Bay District Schools Launchpad icon. Students' usernames and passwords for Launchpad are the same as their Bay District Schools username and password. On the Launchpad dashboard, there is a textbook folder and students just click on the appropriate icon. Not all icons shown will be accessible by all students. It will depend on course schedules. What happens if the Chromebook is broken or damaged? 
Students and parents will be responsible for district-owned technology that is issued to them just as they are for other district-owned items such as textbooks, calculators, cameras, athletic equipment, library books, or band instruments. Please refer to the Chromebook contract found in Parent Portal. Bay District Schools has planned for accidents and normal wear and tear. All district Chromebooks include parts warranties and accidental damage protection. Students' loss of a Chromebook is not covered in the warranties or accidental damage. Damaged or non-functioning devices should be turned into the school's media center so a repair ticket can be generated. Some problems can possibly be repaired at the school site, which may take a day or two. Other repairs may require the devices being sent out to the manufacturer for repair, which can take several days. Students who are without their device due to repairs will be issued a loaner to use during school. The school principal has the discretion to not issue a loaner if there is a documented pattern of negligence to the issued device. What happens if the Chromebook is missing or stolen? The Chromebooks will have tracking software installed. The district can track missing or stolen Chromebooks and find the location. What are the best ways to take care of your Chromebook? The Chromebook screen can be damaged if subjected to rough treatment. The screens are particularly sensitive to damage from excessive pressure on the screen. Do not place anything near the Chromebook that could put pressure on the screen. Do not place heavy items on top of the Chromebook that will press against the cover. Do not poke the screen. It is not a touch screen. Do not place anything on the keyboard before closing the lid. Keep food and drinks away from the Chromebook to avoid attracting ants, roaches, and other insects. Clean the screen with a soft, dry, anti-static or microfiber cloth. Do not use window cleaner or any type of liquid or water on the Chromebook. Do not carry the Chromebook while the lid is open. If you have any further questions, please check out the GoConnect one-to-one -one website at www.bdsgoconnect.com. Congratulations, you have completed the Chromebook Parent Informational Video.